We first heard Mandy Barnett's amazing voice more than 20 years ago when she starred in Always Patsy Cline at the Ryman. She was only a teenager then with talent well beyond her years. She recorded a number of critically acclaimed albums, toured internationally, and the reviews are always the same. High praise for that incredible voice. Mandy, welcome back to Talk of the Town. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Good. Thanks for good. having me. Yeah, good to have you with us today. I want to chat just a little bit about uh, some of the songs and the, 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 the classics. Uh, for you, you've always had kind of that, uh, that, that taste for doing classic songs, classic artists. Where did that love for, for, for I guess, the older music come from? Well, I'm an only child, mm -hmm. and I spent a lot of time with Grandma <laughs> and, uh, and some of my great aunts and uncles, and, and so I was exposed to all this great music, and I just I loved it and started singing uh, at an early age and sang a lot of those great songs. Yeah, so you started singing in five back over on the plateau at Crossville, right? Yeah. So singing around Mom and them's house or Grandma and them's house? I did, and of course, you know, I sang at all the local uh, doings, you know, the fairs and uh, whenever they needed the national anthem or God Bless America, they'd call me little Kate Smith. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> and I guess pretty popular too on the FFAA and the 4-H beat. Yeah, that as oh well. yeah, I was secretary of the FFA. Ah. All right, so we've got a big event coming up here with the uh, Nashville Symphony in, in just a little bit. Uh, you, you've done uh, things with them in the past, so yes. talk about what we can expect to see here in a uh, few weeks. Well, it's called the Nashville Songbook, uh -huh. and I'm going to be singing some of the great classics that came out of Nashville. And they're not all country because, you know, the Everly Brothers recorded many of their hits here. Elvis did too. Mm -hmm. Roy Orbison cut some of his hits like Crying and Dream Baby you know, some of those great, great songs. So classic country, some of the classic pop and, and rock. So as you're going through thinking, okay, what do I want to do? There's such a rich history. Yeah. I, I, I guess, what's the thought process on which songs finally ended up making the cut for this event? It was very difficult because like the Great American Songbook, it's very vast. I mean, there's just no way to include them all. But I chose some of my favorites and of course some that I felt like I could do justice. Um, but there's many that I had to leave out, and but you know maybe there'll be a volume two. You never know. <laughs> and the symphony <laughs> is a great place. You're performing with them is great. Yes. Uh, but that's also a great venue to hear music. It is. The acoustics in there are just wonderful. And when you perform with the symphony, it just elevates your performance to a whole other level. And um, I just I love working with them and hearing these songs come alive like sweet dreams. You know, mm -hmm. you hear that intro with the strings. That's a whole other, that's a whole other experience. <laughs> All right, so we've got this. You've got a few more concert dates between now and the end of the year. Yeah. What's next career-wise? Got uh, any other music that's uh, about to drop soon? I've got a new album coming out next year. It's called Strange Conversation. Mm -hmm. And um, so I've been working on that and um, getting prepared for that. All right, super. Spring, summer? Probably still around the summer. On still working on it. Okay. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, it's mm -hmm. always great to have you with so us. So great to be with you. Come on out and uh, hear her. And again, that's a great venue. And go listen to that amazing voice. Mandy Barnett, Mar Barnett will be with the Nashville Symphony next Thursday, Friday, and Saturday at the Symphony Center. Get details and tickets online at NashvilleSymphony.com.